Yeah. What a weird siren just before that. Floor that mother. Floor that son of a bitch. Wow, that's a weird siren. Was that a premonition? I was just thinking about that a few minutes ago as I was seeing if I could get a response here from Fire Station 19. Interesting. Oh yeah, it is a cop. Ah, oh, fuck, everything is in my way today. Sweet. Fuck, I've been here not even five minutes, man. <laughs> Code three. Wow, that's impressive. Sunday afternoon, May 26, 2019. I was walking down here, here on René Levesque, as we call it jokingly, Boulevard René Levesque, and I see this police presence over here. And I hear a whole lot of hullabaloo and yelling. I figured it sounds like a protest of young people, you know? Look at that, and that was another reason why I wanted to film that. Brand new Police Interceptor Explorer, new colors. Saw the damn thing drive right in front of me uh, a few days ago or a week ago or something anyway. See that guy just went by his bike, he's like me, talks to himself. You know, I think it's actually the first time I see one of these in the sun also, on top of that. And this basically are the units that are going to be replacing the caravan. Somebody recently was telling me too, like they were asking like, why do they have caravans? I'm like, I don't know man, I guess because they can bring more stuff in there, I guess, I suppose. Oh, this is all what's happening here, eh? Oh, some sort of a sit-in there, eh? As long as it's not a hunger strike. Well, I hope it's a lot better than last time I saw protests. They were protesting racism. I mean, come on. We are all racist, right? You know what I mean? Now, he's not even busting a smile, for Christ's sake. He should have been a gendarme there. What do you call it? Royal Guardsman. You guys look like you're posing for a picture. Well, there you go. You're all going to be on YouTube. Bonjour tout le monde. No, I'm serious. Oui, vous? No, it's fait beau, c'est pas l'hiver, it's great. No, no, je suis un amateur police, don't worry. Whatever they're protesting, je probably pas d'accord. I'm old school. Take care, guys. But you see, this is what I like to see my tax dollars being spent on. Cruiser after cruiser after police, police. You can't take chances when it comes to protests. Anything could go wrong. And as Chief, as Chief Wiggum once said in the Simpsons episode, break out the tear gas, boys. Just kidding. <laughs> That's what he said, though, but I'm not saying for this situation. <laughs> so, just a little police moment for you guys who love police cars and love or like the police. And if you don't like the police, well, I said it before and I'll say it again. Either you've had uh, really bad luck with bad cops or you just, uh, you just fucking easily get yourself into trouble. What can I tell you? You know? What can I tell you? Well, just to go along with things here... There's a uh, CBC uh, broadcasting truck, or if you will in French, Radio Canada, which probably more Radio Canada. Man, this thing looks brand new, actually. And uh, it's funny because my landlord actually used to be used to work for Radio Canada. Yeah, go figure. Oh, God Almighty! It's a Euro truck with an American name on it. Yeah, I would have rather not wanted to see that, but anyway, whatever. Whatever, whatever, right here on the René de Vega Boulevard, formerly known as Dorchester. Yeah, we'll finish with some scrap, what do you think? No, what's that? And more scrap. Well, that's it.